If you're an avid or novice camper and you're looking for a way to include your Wrangler and make the most of your cargo area, this officially licensed Jeep tailgate tent will be a great addition to your 1976 to 2018 CJ, YJ, TJ, and or JK Wrangler. Now this will be great for any Jeep owner who wants a fully functional and easy to use tent to take on their adventures, whether you're just getting into it or you're a veteran when it comes to camping. This will also be a great solution if a rooftop tent is a little bit too much for your build when it comes to the extra weight or modifications and you're just looking to keep it on the simple side. Not to mention, this will be a good looking tent with neutral colors to match any rig in the officially licensed Jeep logo printed right on the bottom corner. This will feature a super compact design when rolled up to maximize your storage space when you're traveling to and from the campsite, especially with this uh, little travel carry-on bag here. Um, but when it's fully set up, this will offer a ton of room with an 8x8x by by roughly 7 foot dimension and sleep up to 4 campers. And the tent will also feature a large door for easy entries, windows for ventilation, and glow-in-the-dark zippers to help see what you're doing at night. Now additionally, this will include an OCM privacy mesh to keep any unwanted bugs or critters out of the tent and interior pockets as well as hooks uh, to store your items and hang your lantern. When it comes to the build of the tent, this tent is going to attach to the back of the tailgate and drape over the top and sides of the Jeep for a secure fit and will be braced with tough fiberglass poles. Now it's also going to hold its own up to the tough elements made of water resistant fabric with tape sealed seams and is going to be CPAI 84 fire resistant certified. This will also include a 130G polythylene bathtub flooring to keep it dry inside and include storm covers and a rain fly to keep water out if you do come into to contact with any inclement weather. Now this will come in at roughly $550, putting this at a pretty average price point for this style tent. Now what really stands out about this is the little details included in the kit that will make camping easier and more enjoyable, as well as the looks, especially with the Jeep logo. Now in taking a look at other tent solutions, this will be simple and straightforward, also not requiring anything besides the Jeep and the tent, as where rooftop tents will usually require a roof rack and will be a little bit more complicated compared to this. Now I think if you're looking for an easy way to create an enjoyable camping experience with a tent that you can rely on, then this is going to be a great choice. Install couldn't get any easier at a one out of three wrenches on the difficulty meter, taking you about 30 minutes to get this set up. Now at this point, we can head over to the shop and check out a detailed breakdown of how this sets up and what to expect. So that's gonna wrap it up for me. Let's go ahead and jump into it. Hey guys, I'm gonna show you how to install our tailgate tent here on our Wrangler. So let's get started. So now first thing we're going to do is we have our tent laid out on the ground just like this. As you can see we have the opening that's going to go over top when we open the door and the window here. We have that towards the front. Uh, this tent is freestanding so you're not going to have to anchor it to the ground. We're going to assemble it here and then attach it to the vehicle. Also we have three sets of poles, one short one, two long ones. I'm going to show you how to put these together. We'll get the tent up and then get it stuck and get it set to our vehicle. So now I'm going to show you how to assemble our poles. You're just going to take them and they kind of fall right into place like this. And I'll finish with the back two here. You probably can't see them. And then we'll get all of our poles assembled. Now we'll start putting them onto our tent. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take our longer pole and slide it through this mesh right here. We'll get it started. And we're just going to feed it through. I'm just going to want to keep feeding it through to you get it all the way. I'm just going to pull it all the way so it comes out the other end. I want to be careful that it doesn't pop out. Now once we get it that far, you're going to repeat this same procedure on the opposite side. So now we're going to stick our center one in. Before we stand it up, just going to fish that all the way through. Make sure we got the even amount coming out both sides. 
just like that. So now what I'm gonna do is gonna put one end end at a time. Now, if you're outside, you're gonna to wanna to pull this tight, get wherever it's going to be, and then put your anchors in, it'll help you. On our case, because we're doing it on concrete floor, I'm gonna put one side in, it's probably gonna slide a little bit when we go over to push the other side, but that's okay, and then we'll get it up in place. So what I'm gonna do is take one end, I'm gonna get the pin in first, like that, and then I'm gonna come over, snap these two into place and then I'm going to go over on the other side and start putting it in where it's got to go and start standing it up. So now what I'm going to do is just grab a hold here and make sure I pull it close to being tight and we're going to get our pin in place here like that. Do the same. Take our clamps and get them where they got to go like that. And now you're gonna to wanna to repeat this same procedure on the opposite side. So now I have one side in place. We have our top uh, bar um, going across here. What I'm gonna do is I unhook this one, just pulled it out, and we're gonna take this one, slide it through this mesh here, get it into this uh, pocket down underneath here. And once I get this in place here, Gonna have to open it up a little bit. Kind of hard to do with just one hand. And then I'm gonna pull this one in there like that. I'm gonna push it back. Get it started. Raise it up. And it's gonna be a little tight to get it in, but it will slide back in just like that and that's gonna hold our tent in place. So at this point, your tent's gonna be anchored down, and now what you're gonna to wanna to do is back your Jeep up until you get to this point here, to where this back of your truck touches this, and what we're gonna do is slide ours forward, and then we're gonna get inside here, and I'm gonna show you how to hook the inside latches, and then get this over top. So now we got our tent up against our truck. What we're gonna do is hook our bottom up here. We have some hooks here, like you see here. We're just gonna take them, Get these in place. You have one on the side here. There's some hooks inside the vehicle here where you just wanna take, hook inside the vehicle, pull your strap tight, same here. We have one over here. Hook that one to our hook there. Pull this one tight. That's gonna seal this whole area off there. Then we'll go up here Remove this one, take this one around the shocks, like so, and we'll pull it tight and get it hooked up. So now we have some of our straps here on the side. First thing I'm gonna do is take this one, put it inside the door jam, and we're gonna pull it tight like that. Next, we have this one here, which we're gonna do the same thing with. Put inside the door jam, and pull that one tight. And then finally, we have this one here, which comes from underneath the vehicle to secure it underneath. I'm gonna pull that one, and get it underneath the bumper, and make it so it goes underneath the bumper like that. Loosen it up here. Get it in place, pull that one tight. And now you have two up top that are going to uh, tie to your roof rack. Now in our vehicle, we do not have a roof rack, but um, if you do have a roof rack, you're going to tie those two to that. If not, they give you some extensions. You're going to get a hold of them, take them to the front and tie them. They want you to tie them to the wiper arms, which you can do that to tie the two front ones. Now you're going to want to repeat this same procedure on the opposite side. That wraps up this review and install of our officially licensed Jeep tailgate tent for 76 to 18 Jeep CJ5, CJ7, Wrangler, YJ, TJ, and JKs. Thanks for watching, and for all things Wrangler, keep it right here at extremeterrain.com.